you're late, young lady, and you have a drink, which isn't allowed. Oh man, I just bought this! Hey, teach, sorry I'm late. Those hallways get a little hard to navigate sometimes. All right, move it along. Oh man, my throat is so dry. I really could have used that orange juice. Say, do you have a drink I could take a swig of? Whoa, Lily, why are you drooling all of a sudden? Hello? Anybody home? Sometimes when you want something bad enough, you'll start to see it. But as it turns out, Kevin knows exactly how to sneak a drink into class. To do this hack, take a plastic phone case and remove it from your phone. Once it's facing up on a plastic bag, take a sharpie and outline it onto the plastic. Once you've done that, remove the phone case for now and cut along your outline with a pair of scissors. Now you should be left with two pieces, see? Next, take a strip of wax paper and place it over the corresponding edges of your pieces before pressing a hot flat iron on it. Do this to three out of the four sides of the plastic. You should have what looks like a little plastic pouch. Now take a lid from a juice box like this one and put glue around its base. Before it has time to dry, place it into the small opening of that pouch so it serves as a little spout. Next, take your favorite drink and pour it into the pouch, filling it up most of the way. Don't forget to put the cap back on. Lastly, go ahead and put hot glue on the outer side of the phone case. Now stick the pouch right onto the hot glue. Once it's dry, stick your phone back into the case and enjoy your juice from your sneaky little hiding place. Need a sip, Lily? Oh, thank goodness. I thought it was dying. And if your teacher wanders on by, don't worry, you're totally covered. Yes, that thing is foolproof. Sneaking a snack behind your teacher's back can be tricky business. What was that? Oh, nothing. I'm just taking in your brilliant lecture. Phew, that was a close one. You'd better be careful, Lily. You don't want to push your luck here. Hey, are you snacking, missy? Huh? I told you snacking should be done at a recess, not in my class. Now fork it over, Lily. Oh man, that's all the candy I have! For this hack, take a stack of post-it notes like this one and draw a large square on the top of the stack. Now take a blade and cut a couple of sheets deep along the lines. Once you've taken out the middle pieces, keep going until you're about halfway down the stack. And last but not least, take your favorite candy pieces and stick them inside. And don't forget to cover it back up! Now when you have a hankering for a little sugar in class, keep cool and let your post-it notes save the day. Everyone has one of those friends that talks and talks and talks, even if it's right in the middle of a geography lesson. And I was like, sure, I'll go to the dance with you, as long as you get a haircut. Shh, I'm trying to listen here. Do you mind? Yep, Sophia definitely minds. Fine, she doesn't want me to talk. I'll bite my tongue, or rather, pierce it. Try this prank on for size. Hey, Ilana, you want to get me to stop talking, huh? Well, this ought to do the trick. Oh my goodness! Sophia! Somebody help her! What now? Oh my! Are you doing what I think you're doing? Okay, if you look a little closer, you'll see not everything is as it seems. Gimme that thing. Looks like we've got a master prankster on our hands. That's it, you're both going to the principal's office. Ranking's awful fun, but it often comes with a price. Look on the bright side, Lana. At least Sophia finally shut up. Shh, we've gotta be quiet. It's test day. Okay, everyone looks hard at work. I guess I may as well get some of my work done then. Wow, look at these hardworking students go. Oh, looks like the head teacher needs to speak to me. I'd better go. Is she seriously leaving us? When the teacher's away, the students will play. Now's the perfect time to pull an epic prank on Mrs. Appleby. Oh man, she's not even gonna realize her mug of coffee is upside down! Quick, clean up the excess coffee! Now get back to your seats before she comes back. We totally nailed that one. Well, everything looks normal here. Alright, where was I? Ah yes, here we go. That coffee's going everywhere! 
I don't remember putting this thing down upside down. Stop <laughs> laughing, girls. You've given yourselves away. I know yelling is not the answer here, but detention sure is. Pack up, ladies. You're going. Detention stinks. But it was totally worth it. Well, that'll ring more true after we're done. Finally, it's lunchtime! And these hot dogs are hitting the spot. Oh man, I forgot to grab a drink. Think I could take a swig of your soda, Lana? Ew, no! You know I don't like to share germs. Hey! Is Mrs. Appleby coming over here? Now it's Sophia's opportunity to play a little trick on Lana for not sharing her drink. Wow. Who knew saying no to Sophia would result in such an explosive reaction? Ooh, I'm covered in sticky soda! Sophia, you'd better run fast because I'm gonna get you back for this! Ah oh, man, all that studying has really worked up an appetite, huh, Mia? Hmm, this lunch is divine. And check it out. Chocolates, yes! Oh man, that was the last one. Major bummer. Nothing like a bag of carrots to cheer a girl up. Jeez, is this banana from 2015? How old is this thing? I'm definitely not putting this thing in my mouth. Wait, I have a brilliant idea! I'm going to stuff these boring carrots in this empty chocolate box. Oh, don't forget about that banana! Seal that sucker up and wait for someone to take the bait. I wonder who the sucker will be today. Oh, hey there, Vicky. What's cooking? All right, let's see what's for lunch today. I'm guessing sushi? Or a wrap? Oh, apple slices and a sandwich. Thrilling. Say, Mia, what would you say about swapping grub today? Well, I guess that could work, sure. Um, this old banana looks nothing like chocolate. And what's this? Carrots? Okay, Mia. Why on earth would you do this to me? Okay, give me my sandwich back. No! But it's mine! Come on, I have two exams this week. This is the best thing going on in my life right now. Yes, got it! Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. I'm starving, man. Well, that's the last time I'm having lunch with Mia, that's for sure. I'm gonna get that broad back if it's the last thing I do. Sometimes you need a little brain food to help you get through a lecture. But chips may not be the healthiest choice. Ugh, it's good. Uh-oh. Your loud crunching gave you away, Mia. If you've got the midday crunchies, you've gotta learn how to be a secret snacker. Stick a pen or pencil through the side of the bag. Now balance it between you and your neighbor's desks. Is it just me or do they actually taste better this way? Uh oh, teacher spotted at 10 o'clock. And when it's time to hide, push the bag on the back and put your notebook over it. Oh, hello. Nothing to see here, just listening to the riveting science lecture. Oh, looks like it's recess time. Hey guys, you've gotta check out this video. Whoops! Ugh, this is so annoying. No worries, girls, I got this. Never mind, I don't got this. Nope, wrong again. Actually, I think I may have the perfect idea. Hmm. Okay, let me take care of this. Let me borrow one of these paper clips. Hmm? This little guy is all we need. Bend the top of the clip back like this. Now bend the tip back the same way. Place it down with the bent pieces pointing upward. Now stick your phone right in the little slot. And voila! Now you can watch your favorite videos comfortably. Oh man, that Vicky girl gets me every time. <laughs>